I thought I was recording for the day. And two more packages arrived. So um, I don't remember what's in them. So I'll open them both together. So we'll call this mystery packages. Hi, Grandma Bev here from Life with Grandma Bev. Let's see what kind of getting dark later in the day here. And uh, welcome to my channel. Now I just finished recording a whole bunch of packages that had come yesterday. And I wanted to take tomorrow off, which is actually Christmas, but you're seeing these another, another time. And Bob went to check the mail and these two were there. So I'm gonna open these because I don't remember what they are. I cannot tell, you know, what, that, you know, turn addresses are for, so I thought I'll just open them both together. This one I'm thinking might be something I had ordered to decorate on the front of the motorhome <coughs> for the holidays. Let's open it first. It looks like it, must have, it took so long because it came from China. Yep, mag magnet reflective light bulb decorations. <laughs> Well, so much for that. Maybe next year. I think I had seen these on Facebook. <laughs> and took a chance. <laughs> Funny smell. Okay, well, <laughs> you know me, my nose. Well, when Bob's doing the dishes in the kitchen, I can tell because I can... Oh, hi. I can smell the dishwasher soap. <laughs> Did you come in to join me? Look at her. Isn't she just adorable? She has fit in so well with us. I mean, we just got her yesterday. It's kind of like we, we got, our family is now complete again, you know? Let's see, okay. So these are, remember when for a while there's all these things coming out with magnets. Magnet ties in the back, you put them on your cars. Well, that's what these are. So it's a whole set. In fact, I think I ordered two sets. These are all like bulbs, because it's really not an easy way to put them on our rig. <laughs> so I was gonna put these across the front. And then there's this guy. This guy. Yeah, it's kind of a rubbery. I know what the smell is. You wouldn't know what I mean, but back when I was a kid, my dad started making rubber stamps. That's <laughs> kind of a little side business. He was always doing things like that. And uh, when he'd be heating up the rubber in the little machine, that's what the smell was. <laughs> and let's see. Let's see. And a Christmas tree. What? Yeah, I know it smells, and a uh, gingerbread man. So, well, yeah, that's such a cute little voice, so verbal. She just keeps talking to us. Yeah. Yeah. We just read about calicos, and they are actually torty cats, you know, so tor torty. Uh, they've got the torty gene plus they have a white gene and so in reality they are what did they say Cal calico with or, white cats with torty colors torty with white on them <laughs> so that's why she reminds us so much of our cat lucy because lucy was a torty yeah and they smell like you too just gonna put it back in the package and put it under the motorhome for next year. What? What, baby? You still haven't come up with her name. Yeah, her name's Mia, but we're gonna change her. I told her now's her chance to start her whole life over. The new identity, new name. Uh oh. She would have to do this on camera. <laughs> okay. We want to take her and get her checked because she, when she, uh, went into the SPCA, she did have a little congestion and an eye allergy. I don't know, eye allergy, but an eye infection. So I thought maybe she's gonna do a hair haul just now. Whew, thank you for not doing that. 
Okay. Well, she's been sneezing today, so we want to make sure. You know, she's been around all those other animals and with the virus going around. <laughs> okay, what is this? Oh, I know what this is. Okay. I'm not going to show you. Sorry. This is one I'm supposed to do a product review on. You're going to have to watch my video that's separate from the product review. <laughs> yeah, what you think, girl? Huh? I'm really leaning towards Peggy Sue or Ruby Sue. <laughs> Remember Ruby Sue from Christmas Vacation? Here, you want to get up here? <laughs> yeah. He, he still smells from being, you know, in the pound there with all those other animals. And she'll get herself cleaned up in good time. So, uh, gosh, now what do I do <laughs> to kill the time on this? What? Silly butt. <laughs> We're going to uh, clip her nails after I'm done here, and I'm going to get some of the butt wipes and clean her butt and stuff. TMI. <laughs> what? What? Because her nails are pretty sharp. They <laughs> probably haven't been trimmed for quite a while. <laughs> So you can see we're going to have fun with her. We just love having animals, especially ones that talk. Yeah. So, oh, she likes me. Woo! The breath. <laughs> Why do you have such bad breath for such a little gal, young gal? Maybe you're not as young as they think you are. Yeah, but that'd be okay. If we find out she's real sick or older than they thought, then um, we keep her anyway. Because we don't give, we don't return animals. Once we bring them home, they are here to stay. And we give them the best life they could possibly have. One kitty we'd gotten from the SBCA, this was uh, Bethany, a couple of cats ago. And uh, she picked us. And when we took her to the vets, they said, oh, she's got a heart issue. She could live five days to 10 years. <laughs> oh, God. We thought, well, we're not gonna take her back. She was already a year old. We'd already grown attached to her. And we said, we'll just give her the best life for as many years as she's alive. And you know, she ended up living till she was uh, six, seven, because I think we had her six years. Yes, she was already here. So yeah, six, seven years. So. And she had a great life. Yeah. yeah. Uh oh. Stinky boo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, please comment below. Share, like, and subscribe. And uh, I hope you've all liked this weird little video, but you know me, what you see is what you get. <laughs> I love you all. Bye.